Develop your own personal style. out for personal style. Hello y'all, I'm Diana Brienne. You know, we all have it. We just may not really realize that we have it and we may not fully have developed our own personal style. And I also believe that we're always in the process of developing our own personal style. Well, I believe in taking time out for my own personal style to be the best me on a superficial level as well as on a deeper, meaningful level. You know, our superficial us is our calling card for others to get to know who we are. We can be the most beautiful, amazing person inwardly, but if we don't have an appealing calling card, often people aren't going to come knocking to see what's below the surface. Now, I'm not talking about trying to be um, flamboyant or, um, you know, attractive in like trying to pursue a mate type of thing. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about just your own personal style, the way you do things, the way you speak, the way you laugh, the way you sign your, your signature, all of those little things add up. You know, many years ago, I had a family friend, um, which was more like an aunt to me. She was more like family than, uh, than a friend. She was actually a very close friend of my mother's and she was from Texas. And she had this, this twang and this sophistication like nobody I'd ever met. Everybody wanted to be around her because they wanted to kind of copy her. I didn't want to copy her. I wanted to develop my own personal style. At the same time, I admired her style. I, I loved her style. She had a very attractive style. The way she spoke, her little mannerisms, kind of the little things that she would say. And so we can often develop our own style, who we are, that fits us. My style will not look like your style and your style will not look like mine. We all have our own unique calling card based upon who we are. Work with what you've got. Work with your own voice. You have your own unique, beautiful voice. I once heard a lady speaker talk about how she hated her voice most of her life. And then she realized that it was her voice that made her famous. People loved her voice. They loved listening to her voice. And here the whole time she had loathed her voice. She didn't like her voice. And now she, of course, she loves her voice because, well, it's made her famous and people want to even talk like her to a degree. So she developed her own personal style based upon who she is and who she was. So I don't believe in trying to be like anybody else. I just want to be my best me that I know how to be. And so I want to develop my own personal style, which of course I've done. I have my own look, my own way of saying things, my own little twang, <laughs> my own laugh. Nobody laughs like me. I have my own unique laugh. We all do. You have your own unique laugh. You have your own unique signature. You have your own unique way of doing things. You have your own personal style. From my house to yours, may God bless you. And I will talk to y'all soon again. Bye-bye.